Hi guys, we made it to the end. This is going to be the final episode of Super Mario RPG and what a joy this has been. We did Bowser's Castle last time. It was really cool because we had like these obstacle courses, these battle courses, puzzle courses. Did not like the puzzle ones. Also, we fought a bunch of bosses back to back. It was really cool. And we beat Exor, the giant sword, and then fell into a portal. So. Time to finish this up. I'll see you guys at the end for some of my final thoughts, and I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Weapon World. This is where they came from? This is where Smithy and them are from. Do you know where this leads to? It looks like Exor is the contact between the two worlds. In other words, if we follow this road, we'll find Smithy. So, what's keeping us? Hang on! Hey, I only joined so I could get my castle back. I'm not going to be dragged along on this stupid hunt. I'm going to gather my minions and rebuild my castle. And you, Mario, as an official member of the Bowser's minions, it's your duty to help with the repairs. Bowser, you're completely missing the point. Ha 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 ha. Why is he laughing? Ma, I ought to rip your stuffing out. Is he made of wood? What stuffing? No, think about it, Bowser. Exor connects the two worlds, right? Even though we defeated Exor, there will be other weapon beasts that come through that connection. Your castle is at the entrance point to your world. In short, the weapons will all pass through your castle. Is that what you want? Um, uh, well, more weapon things coming to take over my castle? What about my privacy? Yikes, this isn't good at all. In fact, it stinks. But I can't just be pals with these nincompoops. I've got an image to keep up. <clears throat> I've got it. No one insults Bowser's minions and gets away with it. I've got a bone to pick with this smithy guy. Come on, Mario. Let's go teach him a lesson right now, together. I'm so sly. <laughs> it looks like we're together on, together on this one. Let's go. Okay, so I think we're far enough into this game that I can... I mean, I don't know. Never say never, right? The one mo time that I... The moment I put these words in my mouth, I'm probably going to manifest something happening. But either way, regardless of if we get a new party member at this late stage in the game, one of the things that I also really... Uh, enjoy about this game and appreciate is that they don't give you like a million party members to like choose from and to level i just i've always seen this and thought there might be a sixth party member but even if it's six instead of five that's still better than like 10 or more it's very nice i like that i know there's some people there's some people that, like, I think Vince loves large party casts, right? But for me, like, like what they do in, like, Chrono Cross and stuff, but I was just like, uh, 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 I can't. Can't do it. Too many. Ooh, 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 ooh. I like this. This is a vibe right here. All right, this is a really awesome song. 
bonito. Screw this. How did I get it to move before? in here. The Glum Reaper and the High Boo. Don't do drugs, kids. Why am I missing everything? Oh, no. Give her some physical attacks so she can get people with her frying pan. What's this guy? Amoeboid. Poor guy. See him there. Oh, my goodness. to another save point. Got the ultra hammer. Hello? Oh. That's not as good as our lazy shell. That's not exciting.
Doom Reverb. It's one o'clock. Time for an ice storm. Marching on. It's five o'clock. Time to view the Aurora. Oh, Lord. Uh, Peach, you're up. You are up. Too early. Let's do this crusher thing. I've never used it before. Ah, I see. Ooh, it's six o'clock. Time to fully recover. Mega recover. Oh, it's only one of the things. Okay. Um. Try to take out one of these little ring-a-dings. Rinky-dings. Like, how much HP do you have? Stop it! No! That's right! Get out of here with that! Hey, I got it! It's gone! It's gone. Oh, no. Let's see. Let's summon Yoshi. Okay. <laughs> oh, that wasn't great. What's a goodie bag? I gotta use all these items. All right, we got some coins. Time is marching on. Okay, we need to... It's nine o'clock. Guess I'll break. Let's see, I want FP now. this gauge move. It's 10 o'clock. Time to garden. Damn it. Party cleanse. Okay. Starry shell spike. We're suddenly in a desert. Don't question it. Bonk. Bowser's kind of hurting. I didn't even realize it. Here. I want to check this guy out real quick. Woo, woo. 
He's weak to jump and lightning. I demand strict punctuality. No excuses. It's 12 o'clock. It's high noon. Uh oh. All right, we're good. We're good. Oh, he's dead already. Take them on. Uh, we've beat how many bosses so far this stream? Oh my god. Oh my god. gauge percentage up if we do some of these fights whoa what is ow what is this guy mad mallet and jabbit Level 25, Gino. Who's wearing my EXP booster? Probably Gino right now. Look at his level. My favorite, like, party probably would be Bowser, Peach, and Gino, but if I didn't have to use Mario, but if I really had to like pick a final party for this game, I think it'd be Mario, Peach, and Gino. Gino's just got so much firepower. Peach has the heals and she has really strong attack too. I'm not really great at Mario's jump move and I think that's like you need that to really use him to his full potential you need to be able to use it better than I do Mallow is kind of, um, Mallow doesn't really specialize in anything. He's kind of like a jack of all trades. Like he has some magic abilities. They're pretty strong. They're really great in some instances. They were really strong early game, but I feel like they kind of aren't as strong now. Maybe if I geared him differently, he would be. Um, and then he has like some healing, so he can do like a little bit of this and that. I like Bowser's utility more than Mallow's. All right, who is this? Mario. Get him some magic. Ooh, let's fight this guy. Machine made. That 
that was pretty, uh, pretty good. Alright, let's, so speaking of Gino, let's bring him back in. Almost down. I thought this was like a boss. I guess technically it is. Maybe like a, a, a mini boss? them time. Let's use our lucky jewel. Here we go. Oh, I don't feel very lucky with that miss. And we can double our EXP. Keep an eye on that Yoshi. Yes. It would suck if I got it wrong. That's some good experience right there. Fighting stuff until we get our gauge up. What is this? Hey, Popo. like a twin dragon <laughs> got a royal syrup to go back oh god oh why did i do it again 
Okay, just jump. Just go here. Okay, go here. bosses we fought oh right he can turn our abilities off it doesn't matter I don't need any of my stuff to beat you it was a little bit scary when I was fighting him the first time I was like oh I can't use my items I can't use my abilities like what any of these attacks but I don't need to it's the Rangers what are they called again should maybe switch huh that drill punch is like crazy my FP on that guy though. That's okay. This revives my FP, right? Maybe not. Oh no, it doesn't. Mm. Let's see. I can use some stuff. we go where am I at where I gotta go special enemy healed 
Oh shit, did I? Oh yeah, Axum Rangers, I forgot. Hey Cecil, how are you doing? Got from the boxes. I meant to do that on Bowser. might take a little bit of time to take out almost down so yeah let's bring in some dps here boom oh nice a froggy coin level 26 Give her some magic. Wee hee hee! Behold, they've taken the bait! Hee hee hee! I guess I can spare a few minutes. Maybe they'd like to play! Maybe I would! show you how I play. Cloaker and Domino. Got a PB. Oh, one's down already? Yeah, what wakelings? How shameful if they were to defeat me. Hey. What the heck is all this? How clobber you? He's got an Arbok. Mad Adder. Domino Mad Adder. 
did nothing. Okay. So, is it like you just don't use magic or what? Yeah, don't use magic. All right. Hmm, in that case, let's bring Bowser back. I'm gonna have to heal him a little bit though. We win! I got confused. We're going this way. Now what? Hold on, hold on. Oh, I healed. Oh, they healed me. They keep healing me. Production is on schedule. This, despite the fact that Clay Morton, Boyer, Spiritovich, and the Axum Rangers were defeated. At this rate, Smithy will have a new army in no time. A uh, new army? You can't be making more weapons. Haven't you caused enough trouble already? Oh yeah? Who are you? This is the Mario. Give up now while you still have a chance. Shut down production now or he'll stomp ya! What did you say, you little puffball? Mad mallet, trash him! Alright. Let's fight these uh mad mallets. They look they're looking pretty mad. They're looking pretty mad. Let's wipe those those angry looks off their faces with murder. Death by frying pan. All right, let's see what you got. Okay, boss fight time. All right, 
it looks like you're the only one left, buddy. tanky but he just died <laughs> i i mean his defense seemed high like my moves weren't doing that much damage but i thought he was gonna last a lot longer than that okay well gino gotta level up level 26 we'll give him some magic you learned your lesson. We're almost there, Mario. Come on. I'm liking what I'm seeing here. What do you suppose this switch does? Hmm. Nothing's happening. Huh? What's with the funny face, Mario? Oh, I know. You're trying to make me look, aren't you? I'm not gonna fall for that one. Ah! Help me, Mario! Boy, that was scary. I guess the green switch controls the crane. Okay. Huh? Toad, what are you doing here? Mario! You, I finally made it up here. Let me help you guys out. Princess! I'm sorry I snuck out without telling you or the Chancellor. I just wanted things to go back to normal. I wanted to do my part to help. Princess! Yes, that's it! Any job that lets me help both Mario and the Princess is worthwhile! But what can you do to help? Well, I carried all I could. Now, what could you use? Oh, it's a shop. And you don't have any new weapons or armor. Well, I, I already have the good weapons, but... Okay, he could get me some tadpole colas. Which I probably don't... Won't need, but I'll buy them. We'll get a maple syrup. We can't really hold. Ooh, let's get some party cleanses. Those are always good. All right. Well... All right. I think we can only hold six. Okay, that's it. That's all we can do here. This is for you. Rock candy. Thank you, Toad. We're almost there. Come on, let's show them. All right. I'm ready. Who's this? Pounders. Here's the report. Sir. Drill bit will be finished on time. We're ahead of schedule. We'll make the smithy proud. Good work, everyone. The harder we work, the stronger smithy will become. The weapons we manufacture here will be... Just think of it. When smithy takes over Mario's world, we can do anything we want. Yahaha. Wahaha. ha <laughs> Not so fast! You sure are a cocky bunch! I rule this world, don't you forget it! It's Mario! The Clay Morton and Spiritovich clones didn't stop him? No! No! Leave Mario out of this! I'm the one you need to worry about, not him! Mario, you're about to make the longest jump of your life! You're ignoring me! And so am I. 
by not putting you in my party right now. Sorry, Bows. That's the way the dice rolls. Oh, they're back. Alive? Well, not after this. Jeez. The pounding never stops. We took him to Pound Town. Hi, Wonka. How are you doing? Level 27. Bowser, level 25. Uh, well. Like the moon over the day, my genius and brawn are lost on these fools. Haiku. <laughs> there, there. There, there, Bowser. It's a not so bad. Um, huh. Well. <laughs> Poor Bowsy. You there. Are you the one in charge here? Do you know what your weapons have been doing to our world? Stop this nonsense at once. I'm afraid that isn't possible. I need to assert a dissent against Smithy will be dealt with by immediate meltdown. M meltdown? You can't scare me. I've got Mario by my side. Dissenters will be eliminated. Production will continue. Oh, I can't talk about. Well, after the fight, our FP will be restored, right? Might as well use it. our gauge that we can use again too oh no they're back crap In. Oh, and they gone. 61 experience. That was scary. But we can't run away now. We've got to kick these lowlifes out of our world. That's right.
What's this? Mario, I'm surprised to see you here. But this is the end of the line for you. This is the closest you'll ever get to Smithy, so savor the moment. Harumph! You'll be fodder for my incredible invention, the gun yoke. Get a load of these guys. not that is not beautiful drink your squirt Bowser, thanks for your uh, help. Ooh, like a ninja. Oh, I don't think a fireball is going to work against this lava machine. chance to get red HP like showing that they're almost dead they just die they just die to Gino this tends to happen a lot get her some attack hmm the production line hasn't halted look Mario this is where the weapons come from must be where smithy makes his weapons to find the last star piece and stop the factory we've got to defeat him first mario there's no turning back now are you ready our quest is almost over and when the time comes come on let's get this show on the road okay i'm ready Are we going to get a lift from this thing? Hello? Kind of reminds me of King Frost. Except more beardy and less frosty. see it there huh already finished your tour of the factory huh all right then how about a little demonstration i thought smithy was a giant sword what is this yo smithy stop making those things and hand over the star piece now what he said huh <laughs> so you're Mario. Looks like we're gonna have a little dispute over the star. Just hand it over and get out of my castle! 
my my we're a little touchy today aren't we you know i'm actually growing rather fond of the place please don't make us go through anymore just give us the star now huh better yet why don't you give me your stars why then i could easily conquer this world then we could get rid of all wishes and create a world full filled with weapons over here now i'll crush you all look at this guy oh all right smithy mr smithy i'm gonna guess he doesn't have any oh what is this the smelter let's go for that that's probably bad news ouch all right plot peak Seventeen thousand HP. Well, that's not a whole lot. Oh, that thing's resistant to magic, or at least fire. Probably, maybe just fire. Ooh. Uh, Mario didn't like that. Oh, he's making little minions. Geno Flash for the big damages. See how that does for us. Okay. more HP than the boss. Oh, that we got the smelter. We got him. The smithy left so far. Annoying! 
Oh no. How in the heck? Whoa. Look what you've done. No. burning seething never have i been so wronged it is time is he gonna transform oh his final form i will show you my real form my true power i will teach you respect and i shall have my revenge <laughs> what the hell Oh, come on, you beauty ants! Use a royal syrup. Full FP. Got a freebie. Okay. Hmm. All right. Let's use some of our phrases. Parties, attack power, and battle. Oh, I really messed that up, didn't I? Let's get the good old Geno Beam. attack magnum whoa was that a one hit ko i'm lucky that he keeps trying to use those against mario attention what am I looking for I'm looking for a pick-me-up candy again 300 straight damage that's good Let's keep using those for a bit oh now it was only 200 damage when she used it
300 damage. Oh, he's changing his face. Ew. Ew. It looks like he's got a fucking dick and balls. What? Well, it does, doesn't it? You were going to say Lego head? No! It's jiggling around! Look at it! What have they done to your innocent soul? <laughs> Ain't nothing innocent here! Hi, RPG fan! What's up? Alright, anyways... I'm being judged right now, and I don't appreciate it. Oh, that didn't do much, did it? Oh, you know what? I think we just need to use physical against this form. again what do we get now is it the tank again no he has more forms than that oh god what is this i think this one we want to use magic against maybe looks like it might be strong against physical attacks our triple move real quick see how that do nice nice oh no physical attacks work quite well against that form too my body and head are burning it's not possible. I don't believe it. No, I'm finished. Done for. You, you meddlers. No.
Yay. Thank you, everyone. The Star Road is back to normal, and... Gino's true form? Nope, he just left. He just bounced. Well, maybe that is his true form. Little light fairy. are so funny you're just like hmm <laughs> your regularly scheduled princess kidnapping I guess <laughs> what if he grabbed her right now it <laughs> just took off with her Johnny. Rebuilding. Look at this cast. <laughs> Everyone looks so wild. Look at the moles. I like the moles. Mal's 
just always fallen over. Oh, hi, Bowser. <laughs> a quaint charming lovely little game that was i liked that it wasn't gonna take me one or two months to complete it's short and sweet and that's something that i really appreciate in my games these days because so many of them take me weeks and weeks and weeks to finish and uh this was really nice to get through i enjoyed the combat i really liked the timing inputs um I guess this was the first game to do something like that. I've seen it in Final Fantasy VIII, I've seen it in Legend of Dragoon, and this is where it all started from, so that was really awesome. The graphics were so crisp, clean, colorful, just so pleasant all the time to look at. And of course, Yoko Shimomura did an awesome job with the soundtrack. A couple of my favorite areas to go through were Boosters, Tower, the Sunken Ship where we met Johnny, and Nimbus Land. Nimbus Land was my favorite. The characters were really fun. It was nice to have Bowser on our team. Bowser was also one of my favorite characters. He was just so funny. I loved it when he had the teary eyes going and um, Mallow and Gino were really cool additions as well. I especially loved the backstory that we got to see with Mallow and where he came from, meeting his parents and him being a prince and everything like that was really neat. I feel like if I played this game back in the day when it was new, it would have made a much huger impact on me because I think it was the first or one of the first to do a lot of different things, especially like the timed button presses um, on the attacks. I just think that this was really cool, but it didn't really bring anything new for me, especially because of all the games I have in my repertoire up to now. It didn't really wow me in any way. The story was really simple. The characters were really simple. It seems like a really nice, casual, cozy game to go into if you're in the right mood and something that you want to just do an easy thing. A a nice little fun thing where you don't want to go have an existential crisis by playing something like Xenogears or a Final Fantasy game or Legend of Dragoon or whatnot. And yeah, I think it's really great. I hope you guys enjoyed my playthrough of it and I would love to play more games like this. Maybe the Paper Marios I think people were saying are kind of uh, in the same vein a little bit. I know they're not exactly the same. Anyways, we will be playing more Nintendo games in the future here so i am looking forward to it more zelda as well later this year and yeah with that thank you so much for joining this journey with me and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye bye <laughs>